We're going to be talking about building a real estate portfolio from afar. Scott from California, this is your video. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey folks, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show here on Holton Wise TV. As always, I'm your host, James Wise, and uh, this is the show where I work with you guys one-on-one, -on -one, right? We work together to build, grow, and start your real estate portfolio. Now, obviously, my longtime viewers, my normal uh, you know, subscribers to Holton Wise TV, you can tell I'm, I'm not in the Holton Wise TV studio, right? That's because I'm at home right now. Recently, we had another child. So, uh, you know, spending a lot more time at home these days, uh, you know, taking care of the kids and whatnot. And the fact that I can do that and still work my job, still provide for my family, still continue uh, to, to work at full levels of productivity uh, at Holton Wise is a, a testament to the power of real estate investing, right? Cash flow real estate, guys. By the way, if you are interested in this shirt or some, some of our other attire, guys, let me hook you up, okay? Use the promo code HWTV10. Get yourself 10% off on your boy JYs for any of our merchandise. All the links are below, right? But that, you know, the fact that I can do this, the fact that I can uh, go into work when I need to go into work, stay home when I need to stay home, it's all a true testament uh, to the power of real estate investing, what passive income can really do for you and do for your family, right? A lot of folks, they work their job, right? They clock in at nine, they clock out at five. They're paid from nine to five. Myself, I'm a real estate investor. I am paid 24-7. I've got multiple streams of income coming in, right? I'm making money if I'm at home. I'm making money if I'm sleeping. I'm making money if I'm at the office. I'm making money if I take my my kids to Disneyland, right? It's, it's, it's passive income, right? These are businesses that work for us, right? And the guy I'm working for today, Scott. Scott, you are from California and you are looking to add another piece to the portfolio, brother. And the property I found for you, nothing sexy, nothing fancy. We're not gonna be talking about um, any crazy or wild real estate strategies, no fancy financing or no money down or subject to or yada, yada, whatever the other gurus or, or folks are pitching these days. What this is, this is just a blue collar workhorse, right? 2120 West 100th Street, Cleveland, Ohio, 44102. Been on the market for a couple of weeks now, listed at 89.9, right? Nothing fancy with this, guys. There is a lot of fluff out there, right? A lot of fluff in the real estate space is talking about all this stuff. Look, if, if you break it down, if you want to be really successful and you want to have the, the financial freedom that I've been able to build for myself and my family, what you need to do is understand that you need to stack solid deals like this on top of each other over and over and over. Doing one deal like this does not change your life going to have a very small impact. But when you start stacking deals like this together for three, five, 10, 15 years, and continue to work that nine to five job until you have enough of these deals stacked together, uh, that's when you really get the freedom, right? This is a get rich slow game, right? Don't try to speed up the process, guys. It's going to take some time, right? But with this particular property, these these workhorse blue collar properties are the types of properties I built my portfolio's foundation on, right? We've got two tenants in there, right? One is paying $700 a month. The other is paying $600 a month, okay? That's $15,600 a year in rent coming in. And the photos, right? All the photos you see, uh, you know, it, sh it shows an empty property. That was the photos that the listing agent and the seller, they took those before they put those tenants in there. So even though you see uh, empty units, right, these are they're fully occupied, okay? Both tenants are current on their rent. But of course, that 15600 
is not all profit, right? Of that 15600 that comes in, right? $8,124 of that is going to go out the door, right? Those are our expenses, okay? I broke it down for you guys in a line-by-line -line fashion. That's what we do here at Holton Wise, okay? You get a lot of people, the people that are talking about that fancy real estate strategy or this or that, they're selling education. They're selling coursework, okay? They're like, yo, buy this, and then you become super successful real estate dude, chicks in bikinis, living on the beach, blah, 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 blah. The difference between them and Holton Wise is we give you the education because the education is the foundation to, to getting into the game. But then we actually give you the properties that you can build your real estate foundation, right? So we're providing you education along with real world properties. And then we will be the property manager. We will be the people that are actually dealing with these tenants, actually sticking plungers in your toilets, actually painting walls, you know, actually cutting your grass, right? So we can't fluff you, okay? I can't just paint this rosy picture like, hey, 15600 comes in. That's all profit, baby. That's not going to make no damn sense, right? Because the way my business is built, I, I break down the properties for you. Then I'm the property manager. My team, we're the property manager, right? We know these types of costs are coming every year. So how many properties am I going to sell you if I tell you $15,600 is your profit every year when I know about freaking eight, at least 8,000 of that every year, you're going to have to pay to operate the thing. It wouldn't make no damn sense, right? So you can uh, be rest assured that we cut you straight, right? That's why people come back to us, okay? And of all these expenses, right? Some are fixed, some are variable, right? Repairs, maintenance, vacancy, and not payment of rent. Cap X, right? 780 a year for each of those, right? These are things you're not necessarily going to be paying, right? Like capital expenditures. That is roof, furnaces, hot water tanks, things like that, right? We got two tenants in there. Both tenants are paying rent. No reason to think that the furnaces and the hot water tanks and the roofs don't work right now, right? There's people living there. The house is uh, habitable, right? But we have to account for those things. So that's 780 that's actually money going into your pocket right now. But here's the deal. Every 30 years, I know you're going to have to buy new furnaces, okay? They last roughly 30 years. They cost $3,000 apiece. Every 30 years, you're going to have to replace your roof. They cost probably like six, seven thousand on a house like this, right? Every 15 years, you're going to drop a thousand dollars on hot water tanks, right? These are things I know happen. So, right now, mid to end of life is where all those things are. So, do you need to spend any money on those things right now? To my knowledge, no, you don't. But that doesn't mean you won't in the future. So I want that money that's coming back to you. I don't even calculate that in what I consider your return because I need you guys to save that because I know eventually those bills, they're coming due. Are you a lender? If so, Holton Wise is looking to partner with you. If you're licensed in all 50 states, go to holtonwise.com. Click the digital media tab to advertise on Holton Wise TV today. And that's the same with the repairs and the maintenance, right? Why the tenants are living there? Very rarely do we go out to these properties and, and do maintenance service calls for these folks, right? The majority of that money is spent like every few years when these tenants actually turn over, right? That 780 that you're saving, you might be saving that for three years and then boom, the tenant moves out and you're spending $4,000 to freshen that unit up for the next tenant, right? And then of course the vacancy and non-payment, right? Why your tenants are living there, why they're paying their rent, there's zero vacancy. There's zero non-payment. But this is real estate investing, and anybody shooting you straight knows that there's no scenario where you're a landlord where eventually a tenant doesn't pay you rent, and there's no scenario where, as a landlord, you will not have to pay for an eviction, right? So that is the most accurate financial estimate I can break down for a property like this, right? So with all things considered, I anticipate your real profit, your end-of-the-day profit, your net profit being 7476 As far as the price goes, uh, 899 uh, you know, I'm not saying that's like a ridiculous price, but I believe that I can go in there on your behalf and negotiate you a better deal. I would target this. I would love to pick this up for you at $80,000, Scott. Doing that would make this a 9.3 cap. And then, of course, you're going to only need to put down 20K. 60K will get lent to you by the bank, making this an average annualized cash on cash return of 22.2%. You 
wanted uh when you reached out to me you're like yo it's time for another video it's time for another property let's get this portfolio going let's build this up you were you know hoping to hit about 15 percent with a you know solid workhorse type property the section 8 type properties the c c type section 8 uh rentals right this the, this one is actually going to overperform that right approximately 22.2 percent .2%, right so you know is this one property going to change your life no brother of course not but you start stacking 10, 20, 30, 40 of these deals together, right? That's how you're going to obtain that financial freedom, right? That's how you're going to be able to work whenever you want, wherever you want, right? Like right now, you know, my kid, he's over there eating snacks 15 feet from me down the hall. I could rip this video with you, go spend some time with the kid, come back, still continue uh, to make the money, profit for my family, and I don't have to to worry about sitting in traffic two, three hours a day. I don't have to be at work 10, 12 hours a day away from my family, right? I'm able to work on my own terms, right? And, that, and that's, that's what the goal of these videos are. That's what the goal of my company is. That's what the goal of working with investors like you is, right? We're trying to help you guys achieve those goals, right? And we do it with what I consider to be the most accurate, picture possible right i just i can't stand the fluffers that just want to just pump you up get you excited let you feel like you know tuesday you're like dude i want to be a real estate investor and then by friday you're sitting on a jet and you're working from the beach and you told your boss to fuck off it doesn't work that way right to to get to the point where you can work 15 feet down the, the hallway from your kids right you have to stack deals like this together for years and continue to build that up and just based upon this one property you can see right you know solid investment but at the end of the day it's only going to net you like four grand right four grand a year does not change your life right so it's not as fancy as people make it out to be guys this is the real nitty-gritty stuff these are the real nitty-gritty properties right so scott you understand that and you're aiming for something modest dude you're like yo 15 percent, i'm good let me keep stacking these deals together right so you know found you one that i think will perform slightly better uh so i'm guessing you're definitely going to want to make the move so if that's the case reply to this email and then my team will start working on that seller we'll write up the contract we'll try to work them down again i think we take it at 80 that'd be perfect and then of course we're going to make that offer contingent on a third party home inspection, right? Because everything I've learned is uh, from the internet, from my knowledge. Uh, that's a lot of due diligence on the outside of the four walls, but we need to get an inspector inside to make sure we don't have any major structural issues or this or that. And when things do pop up, I'm able to then leverage that and try to renegotiate, possibly get us a better price, right? Like to my understanding, I'm anticipating a roof, furnace and hot water tanks mid to end of life right remember those last between 15 and 30 years however if our inspector gets in there and he's like yo uh this thing is gonna blow or hey man this roof is leaking i can go back to that seller and try to work out a better deal than eighty thousand dollars right so uh of course this is the start this is the starting point but as more information becomes available that's what me and my team do we get to work for you right i don't work for the seller i don't have anything to do with the seller never met the seller this is not my listing holton wise isn't selling this a company called local real estate is selling it right so i don't have anything to do with this i work for you i work for you alone and then after the deal closes that's when my team gets involved and starts handling that property management because of course brother you can't be in California and Cleveland at the same time. That's what my team does, right? We allow you that freedom to have your money work for you. Everybody else, quickly, uh, if you like what I'm doing, if you like what my team is doing for guys like Scott, you want to get in the game, holtonwise.com, property search for sale tab, click the MLS search analysis show. Also have links to it in the show notes below. Uh, if you still have questions, reach out to my team, set up a phone call, We'll talk to you guys. We'll get you the information you need to see if you want to start working with my team, having videos like this come out specifically for you, right? Because if you're watching this video and you're not Scott, this video is not live. I probably sent this to Scott months ago, okay, privately, and I only release them for free on Holton Wise TV for you guys to learn and educate yourselves, right? There's nobody out there who can go buy 2120 West 100th, right? This is, this is off market. 
this has uh, already happened, right? I, uh, Scott got this information in real time. You guys are getting it a couple months later, just so I can continue to be as transparent as I can, guys, right? So that's what we do. That's our program. That's what this game's all about. Thank you for sticking with me, folks. As always, I'm James Wise. I think I, I literally hear my kids screaming. That, that's, that's part of working uh, from home sometimes, right? That, that's what you get, right? As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.